Tomorrow is a big day for Charlotte's police force. The chief has called a news conference to publicly announce the reorganization of the police department, and some say it's badly needed. WCNC's Michelle Bowden is live at 11 tonight. Michelle? We're in the Sedgefield community, a neighborhood that for a while was plagued by break-ins, but people here now tell me things are pretty much under control, and they say that's because of increased police patrols, and that is exactly what the chief's been saying he wants to do all across the city. The pie is about to be cut up differently. It's just a different style. The pieces of Charlotte's police department will change shape come Friday. That the, the chief is, is making up his mind on what he wants to happen, and he's, he's making that happen. Likely major changes. Some departments, like the international relations, are expected to disappear completely. Street crimes, the traffic unit, family services, and crime prevention merged or cut. Also, there are more officers on the streets. Anybody in the law enforcement profession that knows anything about what we do will tell you that patrol is the backbone of your organization. Members of Neighbors for Safer Charlotte met with the new chief a few weeks ago to talk about Charlotte's problems. I think we're starting to see some of what he's talked about doing put into action. David Romero was at the meeting and thinks more officers on patrol is a good start. I think it helps uh, from a perception problem. And make sure that what we do in patrol strengthens patrol but enhances the relationships that we built over the years with the community. And there's been a lot of speculation about exactly what's going to happen with the departments and the reorganization. All those questions will be answered again at a news conference tomorrow, scheduled for 2 o'clock, of course. We will be there. For now, reporting the news live with our WCNT mobile newsroom in Sedgefield, I'm Michelle Bowden. All right, Michelle.